So we have my electric eyes here, which is an electric timing system. So I allow the athletes to run through. These electric eyes will capture the times and they, using a radio frequency, will shoot back the times electronically into my laptop where that I can then analyze their power and their times and go from there. On the sci That's where the science really starts, is once those times get inputted into my computer. So these electric eyes are state of the art. They go to a thousandth of a second. That way I can make sure that everything is done extremely accurately and that all the times are valid and reliable. Okay, Chris, so this first 20 yards is for you to get up to full speed and then even accelerate faster, as fast as you can for the last 40 yards, okay? So we'll start in that two-point stance, get low. You'll build up to full speed. By the time you hit the first set of electric eyes, you'll be accelerating into your second gear at full speed all the way through, okay? We'll do about five of those, but I want you to start at a gradual 50%. Basically we have my laptop here which is connected to my electronic timing system. On the laptop I have a power uh, database which allows me to analyze the athlete's times and basically come up with their next workout also and make sure that I'm working on the proper distances so that each workout is individually tailored towards the athlete's needs. So we, we basically record all of their times, we analyze it from a power standpoint using graphs and then we basically are able to determine how much effort the athlete's giving, what areas they need to work on, and what feedback I need to give the athlete so that each workout is individually tailored. That way we're maximizing each athlete's time here. So every minute that they spend with me, it's being used towards increasing their power and ultimately making them faster.